people could say about the generation that we live in. He's talking about his times. We live in the worst generation in history. It's so bad. Yeridat dorot. If we lived in the previous generations, we would have been so great. We would have been able to serve Hashem much better. Ah, oh, but what can we do? What can we do? We're just trying to survive over here in this generation. And we walk around with excuses. It's the worst generation. It's the worst generation. He says, I say the opposite. The generation that you're in is the greatest generation for you. And you have to praise and thank Hashem for living during these times. And he quoted a Gemara. The Gemara says, Ben Zoma was once standing on the Harabayit, watching the throngs of people come up during the Shalosh Regalim. And he said, Hashem, you're so kind for the blessing you gave us. During the days when you told Adam Harishon, Beze'ata Pecha Tocha Lechem, how hard was it for Adam to get a piece of bread? You know what he had to do? He had to plow the land, seed the land, water it, harvest it, put everything into bundles, thresh, winnow. Then he had to go and grind it up, make flour, do borer, finally put it, knead it, till he gets it in the, and the, bakes it. What a process for us to have a piece of bread. We go to the corner, here's a dollar, here's a little quart. Can I have bread? Thank you very much. Ready made. Everything is right at our fingertips. You know what a generation of Beracha we live in? In the olden days, to get a pair of clothing, you had to plant the flax and wait for it to grow. In our generation, you could press a button and have everything delivered right to your doorstep. You don't have to walk out of your house ever. Everything's delivered to you. What a time that we live in. What a generation. Hashem, you're so kind to take the same item and look at it two ways. Oh, we live in the worst time. We live in the worst generation. Hashem, look what you gave us. You gave us so much. How much emunah have, do we have? 